Hey folks, please enjoy this clip from our show, which you can find every single day at 4 p.m. Eastern exclusively on Rumble. We've been doing the best shows we've ever done, completely free of censorship and on a platform that actually supports us. You can also support us on Locals where you can access a ton of exclusive content, movie riffs, as well as an archive of over a thousand full episodes going back as far as seven years. We've also teamed up with Merch Engine to bring you a new lineup of really awesome quality shirts, hoodies, and now even hats. So come check out our untested uncensored show on Rumble every single weekday at 4 p.m. Eastern. You stupid idiots. All right. Uh, you're going to like this. So Pessy has an irrational fear. Uh, not irrational. Let me let me fix it. Irrational fear of hot air balloons. Okay. Why? Watch this. No, Pessy, no, no, watch no, no, this. No, no. Let me just show you. Let me just show you. Pessy, when, the, when was the last time there was a fatality oh. at a hot air balloon? Okay. Give me one second. Hold on. Google. Okay. Let's go Google. I do this. Virgie, I do this All this time. Month. Okay. I'm going to go hot air balloon death, uh -huh. and then let me just, uh, tools, anytime, let's do past week, <clears throat> news, there we go, three days ago, pilot killed in balloon crash, took one last flight doing what he loved, <laughs> three days! And hot air balloons are killing machines, but let me tell you something, Pessy, let's not sleep on skydiving. Is this the skydiving? Is the skydiving center the deadliest in the U.S.? This is the deadliest skydiving place. I don't know, bro. We watched a couple death. survive a Puerto Rican skydiving. That's a really good <laughs> point. By the way, guys, may I recommend Marriage Rescue? John Taffer saving marriages. Yeah. Oh my Every God, that would be so awesome. There's an Virgie, entire. Watch. It it was. They only had one season, and there's an entire. Six, this was a real thing. There's Virgie, an entire. We've been watching it daily. There's an entire. Six episode, six one hour episode season called Marriage Rescue. Nuts, dude. And John Taffer, these people don't know John Taffer is going to be there. They think they're going to be on some marriage counseling show. They go to an all include, by the way, really pretty all inclusive resort in Puerto Rico. And then while they're fighting, John Taffer shows up. And you know what he does? Shuts it down. He fixes man. Because here's the thing. Here's the thing, Virgie. Pessy, help me out here. John Taffer just doesn't fi fix bars. He fixes, he fixes people. He fixes people. He fixes people. He fixes people. Now, Virgie, this this marriage is failing. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna knock down some walls and we're gonna fire some people and we're gonna turn this whole marriage into a speakeasy theme. Okay? Uh -huh. <laughs> That's what you cook for him, bro. Virgie, you want to know the funniest part of it? And we've pointed it out. He can't help but be John Taffer. So it's like he. So what they do in the beginning of every episode. They let the couple fight for a bit while he stands around the corner watching them on a little handheld monitor. It's hilarious. And he chooses when to run in. <laughs> Fucking awesome. It's hilarious. There's, you have to watch it. It's so good. <laughs> Fuck this. Can we watch that? I, no, no, because I need prep for Daywave. Oh, God damn it. God damn every it. Year, hey, Virgie, damn. be awake tomorrow morning. <laughs> I know, man. I seen the link today, and I was like, fuck. Every time Roy sends me the link, I know I missed something amazing. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Every, year, Every time, dare dude. Devils skydive out of planes an estimated three million times, and accidents are rare. But on this young man's very first jump, the chute failed to open. First jump. Yeah, that's why I'm never gonna have a first jump. And, and he and the tandem diver both died. That's fucking Here's terrifying. My question. Okay. Here's my question. That's fucking terrifying. Lisa Guerrero has haunting Lots video of other month. exciting things to do, right? Where, like, you don't pancake. Yeah. Moments it leading up to the deadly plunge. My name is Tyler Turner. I am going to jump out of a plane. It's hunt. <laughs> I don't mean to laugh. But, uh, the thing about that trick is Oof. you can only do it once. Video of a teenager's final hours. A, it's a teenager? Fuck me. I feel bad. God damn it. 18 year old Tyler Turner is about to jump out of a plane, and his mother is there to watch. Oh, come oh, on, no. man! I didn't I, feel bad because he was a teenager, but his mom filmed him doing the goofy scream. Yahoo! <laughs> We're gonna make it. The parachute jump was a high school grad. Oh, the narrator, he did not make it. Graduation <laughs> gift from his mom. Oh no, she paid to kill her son. Oh man. Oh, she paid to kill her son. Oh, Virgie, don't put it like that, man. Oh 
Oh, she literally paid. Oh, Virgie, when you leave it to Virgie, because we're just like, oh, this is sad. She got him like a nice gift. And Virgie's like, she paid for her son's death. It's like, Jesus Christ. She did, though. I know. Shortly, he probably didn't even want to do it. She just told she fucking talked him into it. Oh, this one's oh, God, gift this from one's his sad. mom. Shortly after making frozen, is that you? In the video recording, Tyler boarded the plane and then he made the great leap. It was a tandem jump. He's attached to his instructor. This is rough, bro. What happened next was a terrible tragedy. Don't show the it. Come on, Inside failed Edition. To open. Oh, no. Oh, come on, Inside Edition. This is my uh, night. Oh, God. My uh, asshole just clenched up. Uh, oh, that's my nightmare. Really <sighs> Hold on, guys. I need to calm down. I need to calm down. Oh, now we got rough, guys. Let me give me a second, please. I love Blues Traveler. <sighs> okay, I'm going to try to get through this video. I'm not going to be a bitch, but this is rough. I'll be honest with you. I'm honest with you. This is this is rough. This is almost as bad as somebody being mean to you through a super chat. And both men Man, that sounds like it would be the death. worst. Everybody um that knew him loved him. Clap your hands. Oh guys, I'm really terrible at reading uh, situations. I'm very terrible at reading situations. I thought we were doing the cha-cha slide. I just walked in. Turns out she paid for her son to die in a skydiving accident. Which is I just sent, which is almost it's a little less fun than a black wedding. I just sent you both a video nope. titled "If the shoot doesn't open, it's just I suicide." No, nope. saw it. It's this dude base jumping, and the last thing he, he turns to the cameraman and he goes, "See ya!" and he jumps off the building, and then fucking you hear the hit on the ground. <laughs> As a mom, mm -hmm. as a I mom, use it as an intro. As a mom of a son that's doing this. Did you feel like you should have paid for him to jump out of an airplane? No, no, don't ask him if he feels responsible. Don't Do you him. feel responsible don't for don't. making him go through? A, no, hold on. For making him jump out of an airplane? As a mom. To his death? As a mom who loves her son dearly and supported him wholeheartedly, how does it feel to be a murderer? Mm hmm. How does it feel that his death is on your hands? Bet that so, won't wash off. It's like squeaking. So and, and here's I, another thing. Uh, Ma'am, one more question. Do you think God will ever forgive you? <laughs> I just turned around. I just turned to my wife and explained to her what we're watching. And I was like, yeah, and this chick here bought her son a ticket to this skydiving school. And my wife immediately goes... Oh my God! She paid to have her son killed. See, everyone gets it. Everybody <laughs> understands. That's what she did. No, no, but when you say it out loud, it's so much worse. <laughs> what? Trusted, the instructor. Now that's a good way to kill somebody and get away with it. It's and like the this, reverse of that movie, Throw Mama from the Plane. Mm -hmm. You know, this company to take care of. Or it's like that movie, Point Break, because parachuting's in it your son 100 i try to make a connection 100 i assumed and would have had no doubt that they next time have a big trampoline at the bottom oh that's genius they knew what they were doing and they were doing it properly the day of his death when tyler's mom saw people still skydiving she says she approached the wait hold on somebody died and then they kept going what can I can I just say real quick, when they show like the memorial thing, there's a they picture of him shredding on a Tyler's guitar, mom's and that is badass. Uh, yeah, he's pretty cool. Hell yeah. Hell yeah, in his Thrasher t-shirt, bro. Saw people still skydiving. She says she approached the founder of the parachute set. Oh, that's ba that's old baby Billy. Uh, from oh Righteous Champs, so that's baby Billy. No, do you know what that looks like? Okay, Lying boys. in my bed. 
No, Wait. dude, ready to rumble. Sal Brandini, want to wrestle? You remember the yeah. old man who fucking teaches him? <laughs> yes. Turn. He does. I asked, how is everything still happening as normal? Why is the everything still- The first time I jumped out of a plane, parachutes were made of paper. And yes, women mom. couldn't vote yet. I asked, how is everything still happening as normal? Why is everything still up in operation? My son just died. He goes, well, you don't stop the freeway when there's an accident. Based. Based old man. Based old man, actually. You know what? He's right. You signed the waiver. What Francine Turner didn't he know at the time. He looks like the type of guy who wouldn't even blink and look at a woman dead in the eyes after her son died and go, well, you signed the waiver. Was that the parachute center in Lodi, California, maybe that the does not look like a professional sign. No, yeah, it does skydive. It's on it's on fucking OBS board. You, you, you know what you're getting. You know it'd be amazing if they did the shot, Royce, and the V just peeled off. You know where I bought my car? Place called Cars. Skydive. Maybe See, somebody the just goes up and paints out the V. Yeah. <laughs> or, or it falls off when they do this establishing shot. The V just peels Bro, off. Bro, that would be the setup of a horror movie. Exactly. <laughs> Sky oh, die. My wife is on the other computer, so let me. I, I want to take a picture of the kid. Okay. I put, if Pessy, you could do this. Take the V and just paint the V out in Photoshop and then put the kid, like, fucking half o like transparent in the sky. Oh no. Jesus Christ. It's a ghost, like a ghost. It's like a ghost. Skydiving ghost. You think there's skydiving ghosts? You think the sky is haunted above this place? Are you saying, Virgie, the sky is haunted the above sky the skydive? Is now Great. Now we have sky ghost. Are you happy, skydive? Point break two, haunted skies. Oh, oh and, and Patrick movie. Swayze can do that because he's dead, like in ghost. Yeah. California Give me may be the deadliest skydiving center in America. Hell yeah, that's fucking metal. Saturday's death is the 22nd fatality at the Skydive Lodi Parachute Center since 1981. Wait, 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 two deaths? Yes! 22 deaths and they're still running? Like, okay, one, or, hold on, like one or two deaths is fine, but like 80, 90 deaths? I need to read this. I Okay. If you do someone, like people I, out of planes. No, I need to read what people... I want to read what people sign when they fucking go here. I want to read this ironclad fucking Holy piece of paper. shit, dude! The skydiving <laughs> school has reportedly been linked to 28 deaths, leaving... How the fuck are they still open? Wait, wait, wait. In 2021, it was 22 deaths. <laughs> it's 2024. There's been six more deaths? I need to read this waiver. How are there six more deaths? Guys, no. We need to stop everything we're doing. We need to stop the skydiving center. They're murdering people. <laughs> They're murdering people at the skydiving place. What the fuck is this? Wonder why the parachute center is still a... Do you like this sign better where it says skydive with arrows so you know where to go? And you know what's holding the sign up? An old tire. The that's arrow should be pointing down. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a tire that fell off one of the planes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Loud to send people plummeting. Bro, I, I just tried. I, I, I Google searched the school, and every link is from a different year. <laughs> oh, no. So this happens a lot. I mean, well, we know 26 <laughs> times. 26 souls have been lost. No. Hold on. Did they say that 26 that because okay well it doesn't it's not necessarily that so if a lot of them were tandem jumps that means there's 13 jumps okay. and then okay, resulted Royce. in 26 deaths Royce I'm sending you a video directly right okay. okay so here here's this is a 13 minute interview owner of Lodi Parachute Center answers questions about skydivers death it is from 2019 what on <laughs> this place is still around oh this is great Oh my God, this is from 2019, holy shit. Okay, my name is Bill Dawes. I own the Parachute Center. We've been at this location since 1981. Been in business since 1964. Yesterday at two o'clock, this is September 26th, I believe, uh, Maria, uh, an experienced jumper, 155 jumps, 
made a downwind run over the freeway when it was a little bit gusty, a little bit windy, well within the limits of her experience at 150 jumps, wasn't able to make it back off of the freeway. Why she went that far downwind, uh, nobody- Did she get hit by a car? Imagine skydiving and getting hit by a car. She knows uh, <laughs> it's a decision she made. She came Ow. in contact with a semi truck going southbound. She got hit by a truck. Wow. Wait, I, she landed with what? I guess driving is more dangerous than flying. On Highway 99, and I'm sure it was fatal uh, at the instant of contact oh with the truck. Oh my God. Oh my she God. Was oh my to the God. Royce, on I, went fucking, I went on their fucking. I went on their. I went on their. So their website doesn't exist, or I can't get on it. I'm on I their have Facebook their website. page. Okay, I have I'm on their, their Facebook website. page, Virgie. They just added a reel today, and it's an 83-year-old man doing a skydive. I just sent you the... Their, okay, so their WordPress site wasn't maintained. That's what you ran into, Pessy. They have a new website that looks but like they it just was made up, in dude, 95. But Virgie, they just uploaded today on their Facebook a video of them taking an 83-year-old man on a jump. Someone died like yesterday. Imagine jumping out of a plane when you go and this is the website you see. Oh, my God. Lee Crumpacker. Yeah, okay. Wait, are you sure this is the same one, Virgie? Yeah, this is it. Was that the guy's name? 1964, this seems like it. <coughs> yeah, this is it. Okay. It's cause the Parachute yeah. Center in Londy, California. Okay, okay. Because cause their, their link on their uh, Facebook page, which is still active, is a different link. There might be it, just... yeah that that one goes to a uh, that one goes to a WordPress site that doesn't load right. Now the person you're trying to reach is not available. I bet oh. they're not. I fucking bet they're not. Here, Pessy, this is a link to the web archive of the website you're trying to. Well, go to. well, well. Here's the. I'll give Royce the here. Here's the. Um, I have another number. But here, the the active Facebook page is a number too. So here's a link. This is crazy. How are you still operating? We want to book a training oh. course. Hey, how come so many people keep like dying at your place? That's fucking weird. Wait, what? Hello? Hang on. Let me, let me sure. turn the volume. Okay, go ahead. This is the parachute center where like everyone keeps dying, right? No, no you, you called a private person. Oh. I... I I am a skydiver, and I have been. Well, there, I'm, yes, that just but, FYI, just so you know, like your number is the number on their website. I'm just letting you know. Yeah, I, I no, I understand that I'm, I'm listed as one of the teachers there, but I think you're misreading the number. Uh huh. Uh, the section that you read, if you go back to the website. If if uh, you want to do this, got AFS it. Training, cool. You need to All right, bye. <laughs> um, that's one of the teachers. Yeah, hold on. Yeah, he sounds, uh, teachy. Is this the same phone number? No, it's a different number. Parachute Center? Hey, I can remember when keeps dying over there. I don't know. It's like 20, 26 people, bro? That's like a lot of people, dude. I just saw the story, and I'm like, I was going to go out there, and I'm worried, like, is, is that, what's, what's that about? <laughs> If if you believe everything you see on TV, I, so that eighteen I, I that eighteen year old didn't die that his mother filmed that was a lie. <laughs> yes, but that's not the only. One. It was more in Florida. It was more. No, I, I, no, I mean, I know I'm not, I'm not defending anybody else's shitty parachute yeah. place, but like, bro, like 26 people, like one or two. This seems like a lot of people. Like, I'm not trying to be a dick or nothing, but I just feel <laughs> like I'm not a parachute expert, obviously, but like that's a lot, right? <laughs> Well, after sixty years, you got to expect to be a few. So no, yeah, you got you got to break you got to break a few skulls to have a parachute place. I hear you, brother. I hear you. Yeah. But I mean, okay. are you guys still open? Yeah, definitely open. Okay, like, what do you guys uh, do? Do you just yeah, like well, scrape every, the bodies off, or how does that work? Yeah, we've been in, listen carefully, please. Sure, we've been inspected by the FAA oh. and the Department of Transportation. Everything well, I mean, but here's the, the thing, brother. Here's the thing, brother. I don't trust the government, legal. though. I don't trust the government. Yeah, the government also said the COVID <laughs> vax was good for you. Why would I trust them? 
<laughs> were any yeah, of the people to... that died on the concrete, were they vaccinated? Do you know? I have no idea. Oh, well, scrape up their brains. All right, man, I just wanted to check up. But all right, brother, man, have a good luck with your place. I mean, you look haunted, but good luck. All right, okay. I love you. Say back. You bet. I don't know why Merce was in here. That was fun. Taper, clip that. <laughs> clip part of the story and please clip that. Oh, thank you. <laughs> you know what bothered me? Is how direct he was. Like, he wasn't even defensive. He's like, <laughs> it's hilarious. People do die here. 